the fourth study is kind of a playground for pianistic delinquents. Nobody should play this piece if they just want to, to show off. Actually, nobody should play anything by Liszt if they just want to show off. The next passage, Liszt writes fingering on it. Every time there's a change of harmony, with the inner voices played alternative hands, bop, 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 bop. So that's just using the second finger and the fourth finger of each hand. So. And this actually produces a much better sound than some people who recommend doing almost legato 2413. If he hadn't instructed with this fingering, might be the first solution you would think of. But it doesn't make the right sound. You have to persevere, practice slowly and make sure that you can do that. Once you've studied it properly, actually, it turns out to be much more comfortable than you thought it would.